In this video, I'm going to be demonstrating how to use Optimism. Optimism is a layer two scaling solution, which as the name suggests, is built upon optimistic rollups. So before we get started, I think it's worth going through the disclaimer on the Optimism website. So the first thing is that it says that these are early days in the life of the protocol, please use your own risk. It's only just been launched and it's quite complex technology where there could be bugs, there could be security vulnerabilities, and those are risks that you need to be aware of. The second thing is that withdrawals take a one week wait time. That means to get your money out of the system, from layer two back to layer one is going to take seven days. There's a frequently asked questions section on the website. You can go to that to learn more about how Optimism works. So this is the main web page when we transfer an Ethereum from layer one to layer two. I have a MetaMask wallet set up here. If you don't have this already, you can go to metamask.io, I believe it is, and download that and set up an account. And it's basically somewhere where you can transfer Ethereum and tokens about across web three platforms. So I'm going to go to gateway.optimism.io and I'm going to connect my wallet and as you can see, I'm using the Coven testnet here. The Coven testnet acts as layer one, which would be the Ethereum mainnet for real funds. And then there's Optimistic Coven, which is the testnet for the layer two. So I'm gonna transfer 0.1 Ethereum to the Optimistic Coven testnet. Let's approve that. Deposits can take around five minutes. There we go, we've got some fireworks and the deposit has been finalized. We can view that on Etherscan. Etherscan is one of the partners of Optimism, so we've got this Coven Optimistic Etherscan.io transaction which shows the confirmation. Now if we switch over to the Optimistic Coven network, you can see we've got 0.1 Ethereum in our account. I think I had a little bit left over from a previous transaction. Now we've got our funds onto Optimism, we can then go ahead to Uniswap. Uniswap V3 has actually been deployed already on Optimism. It's live and it's ready to go. So here we're using Optimistic Coven. We've got 0.1 ETH in our account. And let's swap that for some, mm, let's swap it for some synthetics. So we're gonna use 0.1. Price impact too high, let's try 0.01. And you can see there's hardly any liquidity here, probably because it's a test net. Let's swap that anyway, just to demonstrate how this works and how quick it is. One of the things that really blew me away was just how fast the transactions confirm on Optimism. You see, that's confirmed almost instantly. I think that's gonna open up a lot of opportunities to build new decentralized applications, which can benefit from these super fast transaction times. We can also set up liquidity pools, just as you would on layer one. So let's create a new position. We're gonna be using ETH and the SNX we just purchased, 0.3. Let's get a really wide range. And then let's max out the amount. Oh, we can't. Prove SNX. You see a transaction fee, 47 cents. That might not be indicative of what it is in the main net, but the developers estimated that the transactions are gonna be about 10 times lower than they are on layer one. Let's create that liquidity position. And there we have it, we've got a SNX Ethereum semi-concentrated liquidity pool on layer two, so that if anyone swaps their Ethereum for SNX, we're gonna start earning fees on that. Finally, if you wanna withdraw funds back from layer two to layer one, we can do that by clicking withdraw. We've got Ethereum, we've also got the SNX. So let's try withdrawing the synthetics token. We have a little bit of this left over. So let's withdraw that to our Coven wallet. And as, and as we discussed previously, on the main net, this would take up to a week. Finally, let's take a look at the stats. You can see it's launched on the 13th of July. We're one, two, three, four days later. There's not been a massive uptake. We've got 5.49 million volume, kind of peaked at 1.5 million around the 14th, 15th. It's kind of declined since then. There's not really a lot of opportunity right now, but I think that's gonna grow. Like I said, I think this is gonna open up a lot of opportunity for decentralized applications, yield farming, liquidity pools. Both Optimism and Arbitrum are the two kind of competing layer twos at the moment. 
They're both kind of launching at the same time. Uniswap was first to launch on Optimism. Arbitrum, I'm not sure what they're waiting for now. It's been kind of waiting to be launched for the last month or so. It's been open to developers, but I think they're basically waiting for Chainlink to integrate some stuff before it goes live. There's exciting times for the Ethereum community, and I think it opens up the possibility of another kind of DeFi summer or a DeFi boom later in the year. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe for updates. Thank you for watching.